Right. If you're anything like me, a bit of a hoon like to go riding and record two cameras at the same time, as seen here. to do. So first of all, what we do, we go into the files, and when you downloaded them from your GoPro, I'll put them in two camera file. Camera one, which is the front camera, which is where I get my sound from, um, and we'll do this video here. So we need to copy it. We need to paste it into a 3D file, which is this one here. You'll see it's named 100M3DR, and I'll paste it in. Let me just take a minute or two. Old computer. Thinking any minute now. Okay, that one's copied in. Just change the name. Comes three D underscore. Uh, double O four. Uh, we do the same with the camera two. Into the left file. Paste it. Wait another minute or two. It's done, we'll rename it 3D underscore L004. That was pretty simple. Um, now I have the GoPro Studio 2, just like that. Import new files. Okay, well, the way the GoPro system works, if you select the right file, it will find the left file for you. There it is. 3D R004 and 3D L004. Now before you go any further, make sure you check your settings. Um, the audio source comes from one camera. Which camera do you want it from? I want it from the right camera, which is my front camera. Um, also, you've got remove the fisheye. Remember the settings high quality. It takes a little bit longer, but it's worth it. Hit the OK button. I'm going to keep the whole clip, but you can just check it. Edit out what you don't really need. Okay, that's enough of that. Um, just check the footage at the end, make sure it's all still there, which it is. Playing it. Yep, no problem. Okay, I'll we'll add the whole clip to the conversion list. Hit convert. And it will take a couple of minutes. So we'll get back to that very soon. Okay, that's finished converting. Check your conversion details against your original. Using the right-hand audio. Same frame and frame rate, 100 feet per second. Give you a really nice slow-mo. Proceed to step two. Okay. Drag that into your video box. Boom, straight up as two screens. Okay, the reason it does that is because of this. The 3D view. And depending on what sort of 3D movie you're watching, you've got a 3D left eye, 3D from the right eye, which is different because we're at the top of our head. You get all the other types of 3D visions here. Now, but the one we want 
is not the side by side because that's horrible. If you go to the free view, it keeps the aspect ratio. Okay, I hit the 3D convergence, turn the white balance on, and hit the play button. That looks good from there. I'm going to fast forward it all the way down there to the end. What's the end of it? Beautiful. Okay, when we hit export, I like to export in 10 HD. This one here, 3D format. Current 3D mode. Export. It's in 4 HD, so it's MP4. And we're calling it GoPro Split. I've got one there. Yes, I'm going to cover it. Save it. Yes. And that's it, she's exporting. So when she comes out of the export, in your media player, it should look like that.